You ready to suit up? I'm ready to practice. <laughs> How did it feel to be back out there? It felt good. Um, um, it's been some weeks. Uh, it's been a while. Uh, you know, uh, excited to just get back out there, get back in the flow of things. Um, but I still got more work to accomplish where I want to get back to. How much practice do you need, Cam? <clears throat> Taking it day by day. Um, not rushing the process, but, uh, you know, the healing uh, is taking effect, but uh, I gotta get reps under my belt. Um, I gotta get more comfortable in what I'm doing. Trust myself, trust my body. Um, but we gotta see where we're at your tomorrow. Condition? Condition's been great. Um, you know, uh, been running every day, and um, you know, from walking to uh, going in the pool to arc trainer to bike. Um, there's been a multitude of things I've been trying to do to just stay better in condition. And, um, you know, even when I'm getting those extra reps, uh, it's like back to back. So uh, it's only benefiting me and getting that under my belt. Yeah, how does a day like today kind of help you through the mundane stuff that I'm sure gets very monotonous to at least get out there on the field? Who's it monotonous to? Uh, you know, I, I miss the, these type of practices. And, you know, I wish I would have got a Wednesday under my belt. But, uh, you know, um, just excited to, to keep asking for more. Um, you know, that's how rehab has been for me, um, checking things off the box and uh, moving forward. Can you get a target game you want to come back um, to? That's above my pay grade. Um, sure, someone's got uh, planned out for me, um, but uh, I hope to beat that one day. <laughs> did, did, today you, you got here and they said, you going today or do you know this week or no yesterday? Or how does that I've been pressing. Uh, and so, um, you know, there's been MRIs. Um, I've had to see more of my progress is that, and you know, got some good news this morning. And, uh, had to get in the 45 MRI, 45 minute MRI this morning, and then pop right over. Was the progress faster, and more accelerated than they expected? You asked Dr. Bradley, <laughs> um, but Did he, tell uh, you? he doesn't want to tell me. Uh, but uh, you know, I trust what they're doing, and um, I know my body, and you know. I know I'm up there in age, but I feel like I progressed pretty well. Cam, you said you know your body. What happened on that play? What happened on the play? Um, you know, I was going to make a sack. Uh, he threw it out. I fell on my legs kind of weird, and it split. And um, didn't know what happened at first, but uh, uh, I couldn't move like I wanted to. Uh, ripped the adductor, and I was already dealing with a core muscle injury. So, uh, you know, both played in the a part, and um, it just happens in the game you play. But not running away from it. Uh, excited to get back out there when I can. But uh, it's been a process. In the moment, did you, with the did you not think game. it was that serious? And no. Said surgery, you no. Were like, what? No. I knew it was bad because uh, I couldn't finish the game. Um, but I didn't know the extent. Um, didn't know I was going to have to be on IR. But uh, you know, it's one of those free things that happens. Ken, what are you seeing with the defense, particularly the run defense? Uh, we're just working. You know, um, is it perfect? No, but I mean, guys are competing, um, and um, you know, it's just about staying in our gaps, getting off blocks, using our hands, um, and you know, I feel like guys are progressing every week. Uh, is it perfect? No, but um, there's a lot to continue to grow from it. In terms of the team, you guys have won a couple in a row. You feel like you're starting to get your feet under you as a group a little bit. Um, you know, we've won some. Some critical games in the fourth quarter, uh, you know, but I don't think we're where we want to be yet. Uh, you know, we still got a lot, long way to go. A lot of football to be played, uh, but you know, coming off the bye to win a, a game is, is pretty huge, critical. You said a lot of wins in the fourth quarter. Is that sustainable? I mean, I guess in theory, no, but you guys have been doing it for a few years now. It seems like if it's a one possession game, you guys find a way to pull it out. Why is that? Can you explain it? Uh, you know, I think. When you look at it, it's just you gotta find ways to win. Uh, you know, whatever it takes. Is it perfect? No, again, but um, just finding the little things, finding you know a turnover there, or uh, making a critical block, or that sets up a, a touchdown. Um, going down the field and kicking a field goal. Uh, whatever it takes from the group, we're just trying to get a W. See, Cam, that having is being in that situation a lot advantageous, maybe because maybe you guys don't 
you cut your eyelids off maybe and it doesn't bother you or it might bother some other team? You know, I think one, we practice it. Uh, you know, it, it, it comes from our practice. Mike T setting up the drills, um, seven shots, uh, two minute drills. Um, you know, you prepare yourself for those moments, but um, guys have been doing it for a long time. Mika, TJ, uh, Kenny just got here, but he was doing it in college. Um, the mental makeup of the group is, you know, find ways to win, and, you know, we don't care, and we don't apologize for it. Would it be nice, though, to rest during the fourth quarter? That'd be awesome, <laughs> uh, but that doesn't really happen a lot in our league. Um, you know, even when you're out, you're really not out. Um, you know, one thing Coach John Mitchell always told me, uh, you could be up 21 points, but that's three plays. So, you know, in our, our minds, uh, there's always a chance to come back. Cam, is this your kindness week? It is my no, kindness like week. Um, you know, we just got a lot better uh, getting the news today. <laughs> but, uh, you know, we, we've done some amazing things. Um, starting off at Children's Hospital, uh, getting to interact, interact with some kids. Um, you know, uh, Tuesday, uh, where did we start Tuesday? I'm blanking. Um, oh, wow. No, Captain Momentum was at night. 50, 50 yard line. Uh, wow. It's been. A, we, then we on Tuesday went to um, Woodlands High um, and got to talk about uh, gun violence. Uh, and then that evening, uh, we were over at Cafe Momentum uh, that. Uh, those kids have been dealing with some harder situations, but they get to uh, learn how to cook and how to deal with financial literacy. Um, and then yesterday we went over to the caring place and um, a lot of those kids have lost parents or siblings. Uh, so it's off to a great start. Um, you know, we still got more to do. Uh, six o'clock I'll be over at Westinghouse uh, talking to some kids, but uh, uh, you know, if you, if, it's a great opportunity to give back and highlight a lot of great that's being done in our, our community um, and how we can help. Man, you know, I, I texted her and told her I was going to be able to practice. She was like, good, your obsessive behavior with lasering every night and has paid off. And I'm like, oh, sorry. <laughs> I, you know, I guess since I've been injured, I've uh, just been doing around the clock treatment, trying to take care of my body. And it's probably gotten annoying to an extent. Um, you know, uh, everybody's trying to walk on eggshells around me, but uh, I'm pretty sure my kids are gonna be jumping all over me when I get home since I practiced. Don't get re-injured. Yeah. yeah, my son doesn't care. <laughs> Deontay, when you look at this, um, what, what, talk a little bit about their pass defense. I mean, they, they've had, they've given up a ton of yards. Is that something you guys think you could take advantage of? Uh, yeah, most definitely. Um, you see, like they run certain coverages on certain down distances. Uh, you know, it's our job to know what they're in, and you know what I'm saying, believe that the uh, coaching staff gonna call the right play in that that situation. You know what I'm saying? So, so we can move the ball and put points on, on the board. But it's like, I would say we just gotta, you know, continue to watch them and just, you know, study them a little more to see like what they really like to do in other situations, um, like when 31, 32, little stuff like that. But it's nothing really we haven't seen before. So it's like I don't want to speak too much on it because it's football. So you just gotta go out there and play at the end of the day. There was some question uh, going into the game with you coming back, fans, was whether you and George could both eat in the same game. Did you kind of dispel some of that? Yeah. You talking some about the last game? Yeah. Oh, yeah, for sure. I mean, we always got that. We, we play off one another, like I always say. Um, he make a play, I make a play. So it's like our little thing. Uh, so that kind of get us turned out that when once we both of us make plays, then everybody else start making plays, and um, you see the offense get us. We got that spark that we need. It shows, and um, you know, so I feel like we did a great job of that. Um, me and George had a great game. The whole team had a, a great game. So you know what I'm saying, like I said, it's just that spark and that 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 thing that me and George got. Deontay, why did that offense work so well in the fourth, and how do you carry that over into this one? Uh, starting fast and just knowing the, knowing the game plan and knowing who we going against. Um, and when you get out there, not overthinking and just being yourself out there at the end of the day, that's really what it's all about, being yourself and making those plays. Coach Teak always talk about being an A player. And he need those A players to step up, and uh, that's what those A players did on Sunday. And you see in the big plays that, that we need to uh, turn the game around, and we did it.
Deontay, sometimes do you overthink, not you personally, but yeah. the, the offense overthink early on? I mean, what, what is the reason for the slow starts and you guys playing so much different and better in the second half? Like Coach T said, how you come off that bus walking into the stadium um, with that mindset? Um, but I want to say it's a problem, but you know what I'm saying? We ain't going to, we're not perfect. So at the same time, it's not like we're trying to come out there and not start fast, but it's like, you know what I'm saying? When you're here to play or whatever it is out there, it's just how, how bad you want it. And we want it bad. It's just sometimes it might not seem like we do, but we do. So it's, it's, that's never the case. So, like I said, we just got to put more effort into it. You know what I mean? Coming out and starting fast and wanting to start fast and showing it. And just keep putting it on film. Do you have anything? Deontay, now that you got one full game under your belt, you're back in the full swing of things. Just how do you feel? I feel good. Uh, you know, I felt a little sore after the game. It's been a little minute, uh, haven't ran like that in a while, but it felt good to get back down the field and just you know, show, show, show the um, still the nation what they've been missing. You know, I'm looking forward to doing that on Sunday. I know we've been asking this every week, but how much do you think you'll be used out there this game? I'm probably going to hit you with the same answer. You know, uh, I'm really not up to me. It's up to the coaches, so I'm just going to try to be ready as much as possible. When they call my name, I'll just go out there. When they did call your name, do you, you feel like you've been in the right places, it seems like? Yeah, you know, I'll try to do, do as much as I can with the opportunity, the opportunity that I have. You know, last week they gave me a little bit more time to run, and I did the plays I needed to. And so I just got to keep stacking and keep, you know, going forward. Joey, what happened out there? Are you going to be all right? You'll, you'll be good for Sunday? Yeah, I'm playing Sunday. Joe, we talked to uh, T.A. today, and he said they're working on tackling with you. What, what specifically, and how's that going? Uh, just really just tech, finishing up the techniques of tackling, you know, wrapping up, finishing, uh, rolling with that, little stuff like that, but it's, it's been going smooth.